Hello, welcome back to another video. My name is Priscilla. I'm a Nigerian women's wear designer based in the UK. And this video, I'm going to be sharing how I change the avatar's measurements on Clo. So Clo is the software that I'm new to. It's one that you can use to create digital fashion for your projects without having to actually, you know, make the pattern and make the twirl. It's a time saver and a game changer. I'm fairly new to it. And if you haven't seen my first, like, overall introduction into Clo. I'm going to link it on the screen so you check that out first. In this one, I'm going to be going behind the scenes and showing how I change the measurements to my measurement because hopefully in the future, I want to create patterns on my avatar and export it as a PDF pattern that I could use for myself, for my business or for a client. So it makes a lot of sense to have the avatar, avatar be my measurement or my size rather than the default size that the avatar usually comes in. So if you'd like to see how this is done, make sure to keep on watching. With that out of the way, let's get straight into the video. I'm going to go ahead and open up the clothes software and typically once you open it this is what it looks like then I'm going to go in to the avatar appearance click on this plain box here and pull in one of the avatars this is one I usually like to work with and from what you can see it's quite slim quite slender and is very different from what my current body size is so we're going to be changing the size and the measurements of this avatar if you go to the top bar and click on avatar and then scroll down to avatar editor this is where you'll be able to make those changes it's going to open up a panel that looks like this and you can see the current measurement of the default avatar the first thing I want to do is change the unit to inches because that's how I took my body measurements. And then I'm going to go onto this section here and click on bust and impute my bust measurement. Now this is the part I think is actually quite cool about this software is once you put in the bust measurement, automatically all the other measurements kind of synchronize and change by themselves. So you can see it's changed, but you can also go in to toggle around or change any other measurement that you want say you want the waist maybe bigger or smaller you want the underboss bigger or smaller you can increase it or reduce it to your liking so i'm just tweaking the around thigh measurement because i have thick thighs and i need to ensure that it's more accurate and closer to my actual body measurement my body has changed since having a baby and i love and i celebrate all of my curves and i want to have an avatar that sits closer to my real body at the moment so this is what it looks like once I was done changing it and I'm just going to remove the lines so I can get a better and closer look and honestly this is closer to my current body shape and measurement. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and found it useful and helpful. If you have any other requests or questions leave a comment down below. If you also like me to do more clothes videos like mini tutorials leave a comment down as well. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and until my next video have a good morning, afternoon and evening wherever you are. Bye!